What's up YouTube? It's your boy Swag Buzz here back with another video. All right, so today is game day. We got Jackson State against Alabama State homecoming. Uh, so I just wanted to do a little video talk about the game before the game. I uh, hope everybody is enjoying their Saturday so far and ready to watch these good games in the swag today. I do swag videos all the time. So if you like this kind of content, like and subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so you'll know when the next video drops. And with that, let's get into the video. So today, the big game today is gonna be Jackson State against Alabama State. Uh, so we got Shadur going to, up against Ezra Gray. Uh, man, this is gonna be a great game. I think, uh, I'm hoping that Jackson State makes it a blowout, but who knows, man? These swag games are so unpredictable. Uh, Jackson State defense is a beast though, so I don't see them letting anybody score on them. This game right here, it's gonna really tell me a lot about Jackson State. You know, they had a dominant performance last week against Alabama and them. But if they come out and do the same thing against Alabama State, that will really put me at ease with what this team is. You know, so if they come out and they're not looking good and they don't replicate what they did last week, then it's gonna be a lot of questions going into the rest of the season, even if they win the game. I'm looking for Shadu to start fast, really going downfield, taking some shots downfield, taking a lot of chances, uh, getting the ball to Rucker, Joshua Lanier, and uh, Corbin. And they also have Wyman now, so I'm looking for Shadu to get him involved in the game as well, coming off the performance he had last week. I think they will rely more heavily on the pass today other than a running game, but I think they will incorporate some of the running game as well. I really like Marshall. I love his running style. You know, I think he, he has a lot of creativity and I like those kind of running backs. So look for Santa Marshall to get his and get off today as well. Alabama State D-line played really well against Jackson State in the spring. So I'm looking for those guys to, you know, try to, try to assert their dominance against Jackson State. They're gonna try to really uh, impose their will on the offensive line of Jackson State, but I don't think Jackson State is gonna go for it. I think Jackson State offensive line has a lot of size, so they'll be able to keep them at bay. That's one of the keys of Jackson State winning this game. They need their offensive line to play well. We gotta keep Shadur on his feet and keep him in the pocket so he won't have to be scrambling to throw the ball. Give him time so he can make the decisions and pick the defense apart. I want to see James Houston get in the backfield a lot today. I really want to see him get a lot of sacks. I mean, the boy's been on a tear all season. So I still want him to keep performing the way he's been performing. I need him to put pressure on the quarterback and just get backfield and sack the quarterback at least. I need at least two sacks from James Houston today. Two sacks. I need Aubrey Miller to be rushing and blitzing the quarterback like he's always been doing. Uh, him and James Houston have been a standouts on the defense so far this year. Um, I would like to see Nugget get off, get off, but they're not throwing the ball his way that much. Uh, I want to see if Ryan Nettles is going to try him. I want to see if Nettles is going to try Nugget, uh, throw the ball to his side. I want Nugget to get a pick six this year. We need to see him get a pick six. As for Alabama State, I think the keys for them winning this game, they have to get Ezra Gray going early. Uh, he has to really run the ball well today if they have any chance of, of beating Jackson State. He's the best player on their team, so it's really all on him. Uh, Ryan Nettles, he has to be able to make the throws, make good accurate throws. Uh, he hasn't played really well this season, but hey, you know, everybody can have a good day. So today may be the day that he plays well. But yeah, they need Ryan Nettles and Ezra Gray to play well today if they have any chance of winning this game. Also, the D-line has to pressure Shadur all game. They have to keep him scrambling, keep him making quick, quicker decisions, keep him uncomfortable. They have to keep doing that all game. But after some thought, uh, my final score for this game, my prediction, I would have to say, I think it's gonna be 42 to 10. I got Jackson State 42 and Alabama State 10. I think this might be another blowout. Uh, if Jackson State plays to their best of their abilities, play like they should play, <laughs> play like everybody knows they can play, uh, I think this game won't be close. But we'll see. You know, this is the swag, and in the swag, anything can happen. <laughs> 
But for the other games today, I'm looking at the Florida A&M versus Alabama A&M game. I think Florida A&M is going to win that. We got Prairie View taking on Bethune Cookman. I think, but I think Prairie View is going to win that one. Uh, we have Southern going against UAPB. I think I think UAPB is going to beat Southern today. And we also have Alcorn versus Mississippi Valley State. I think Alcorn has that game, but don't be shocked. The Valley, you know, shocked them. Who knows, man? Like I said, this is the swag, and sometimes in the swag, anything can happen. You just can't look over a team because if you do that, you'll get beat. But the next game we have is Texas Southern against Grambling. I have... I said I wanted Texas Southern to win this game because, you know, that new quarterback that Texas Southern has, he's been playing really good. But I don't want to sleep on the G. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to change my pick. I picked Texas Southern at first, but you know what? I got Gramlin winning this game. I got Gramlin. I'm going to respect the G. I got Gramlin beating Texas Southern today. Uh, but, yeah, man, those are the games for today. I hope y'all of y'all enjoy the games. I may stream one of them. Uh, I haven't decided which one yet. I may do the Jackson State versus Alabama State game. Uh, and I may stream another one later on, one of the later games as well. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, just hit the notification bell on the channel so y'all will be notified when the uh, live drops. But yeah, man. Uh, oh, yeah. I, I posted a video about Jackson State's new practice facility that they're building. They, they uh, the design company put out the designs for the uh, practice facility. Looks pretty sweet, man. Looks very dope. Uh, it's such a beautiful thing for Jackson State to be getting things like that. And I hope all the schools in the SWAC can follow suit and get something com comparable, or you know, just as nice as what Jackson State has. So we can get more players wanting to come to the SWAC. More students wanting to go to the school, increase enrollment and everything else. So, yeah, man, what's going on? I'm loving what I'm seeing. But like I said, if you like this kind of content, like and subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you'll know when the next video drops. Enjoy the games today, and I'll see you guys on the next video. All right.